Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the next question. Okay, so this question belongs to Gate CSC 2017 set 2 guys. The given question is consider the following statement about the routing protocol RIP that is nothing but routing information protocol and open short oh, open source shortest path algorithm OSPF okay in IPv4 network. Okay, so what they are saying is RIP uses a distance vector routing. Okay, so that is absolutely correct. Okay, so they are saying the next statement says that RIP packets are sent using UDP. Okay, so anyway, let us keep it aside for now guys. Okay, similarly option 3 says that OSPF packets are sent using TCP. Okay, so let us keep it aside for now because I think I did not explain you like which is which, right? Yes. So OSPF operates operate, operation is based on link state routing. Okay, so I am sure that I explained about RIP and OSPF and I think everyone can surely say that 1 and 4 are correct. So with that understanding, can I eliminate any options? I can eliminate D because if there is one, there is no one in it because we are searching for correct answer. And similarly, okay, so similarly I can eliminate B also, right? Yes. So now we are left out with A and C. Okay, so if you observe carefully, so from here only we can directly say that option 3 is wrong right because the only chance for this is option 2 might be correct or not that's it so based on that only the answer will depend right yes okay so rip packets are sent using udp here this statement is true guys okay so basically rip packets so basically what are these rip packets guys so rip packets are nothing but so whenever we create routing tables so those tables we will share right if you recall recall in distance vector routing we have discussed so the second step is nothing but sharing right so once you create your table you will share it with your neighbors so in that way only the whole thing will occur so basically these tables are shared with the help of the concept of udp guys got it yes okay so that is the reason why this option is correct and we are coming to option 3. So when it comes to OSPF packets are sent via TCP. So basically these OSPF packets, remember it guys. So OSPF packets are not sent by TCP nor by UDP. So those are just sent with the help of IP address, IP header. So basically it will be sending with the help of IP protocol. That's it. Got it? Yes. So with that conclusion, I can say that C is the correct answer and I'm really sorry for missing these two points, guys. So RIP will send the packets in UDP and uh, OSPF will send that particular packets with the help of IP directly. So there is no need of any transport layer protocol to send the OSPF packets. Got it? Yes. So it's a quite easy question, but the only thing is I did not explain you the concept. So it could be a bit tough, right? Yes. So I hope everyone got a clear idea on this. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question. So if you are having any doubt, like how exactly they work, I have already explained you in the course lectures, guys. So please watch them. Okay. Yes. So I hope everyone got a clear idea on this. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.